Two psychologists, two different findings. The issue, whether a Boleyn boy who was just 10 years old when police say he killed his father is competent to stand trial. News 13's Crystal Gutierrez just returned from the boys' competency hearing in Valencia County. She's live in the news play. And Jessica, the state psychologist took the stand today and told the judge Benjamin Hilburn knows exactly what's going on from the charges he faces to what consequences he could face. From a psychological perspective, he's competent. Dr. Samuel Roll was hired by the state. Today, he told the courts that despite Benjamin being so young, he understands just about everything that's going on in his life. Most of it had to do with what the patient himself was able to tell me. For example, he was able to tell me that he has been accused of murder. Roll says Benjamin also said he knows he could go to jail. The 11-year-old is accused of shooting his dad in the back of the head in 2009, ultimately killing him. While his dad lie bleeding on the floor, the boy called 911. Police say Benjamin told them he did it because his dad was too strict. The state's expert recognized the boy has had a tough life, but says that does not deem the child incompetent. All of the tests becomes either above average, superior, or gifted. But the defense says the state's expert tested the boy too long after the crime was committed, more than a year. And that's why the evaluation does not match their experts, Dr. Schwartz. Dr. Schwartz's assessment is that he is not competent to stand trial, and a lot of it has to do with um, the... Um mental capacity of Ben at the time and now. The defense's psychologist tested Ben when he was 10. He's now 11, almost 12. But age is not their only argument. The defense says Benjamin also suffers from ADHD and attention deficit disorder. And the state's expert says attention deficit disorders do not play a role in deeming a person incompetent to stand trial. The defense says their expert can prove it does, but its doctor was not there today to argue because of last-minute schedule change. Therefore, the judge did not make a decision today. Back to you. Okay, Crystal, the state's doctor also said during his evaluation, Benjamin told him that, quote, he wants his attorney to help people understand that he did it for a reason, but would not say what that reason was.